Wildlife Wednesday. Mangrove tree crab. Hello everybody, my name is Atiyah Atkins and on this Wildlife Wednesday we're going to be covering the mangrove tree crab. The mangrove tree crab eats red mangrove leaves and helps keep the mangrove estuary clean by removing leaf litter. At high tide, the mangrove tree crab will be at the top of the treetops and at low tide it can be found on the ground. They are small and omnivorous. Um, they only are about an inch long and they use their speed as a defense mechanism because they can run up to one meter per second. Let's check in with park naturalist Christine McDade over at Ann Cole Nature Center for a closer look at the mangrove tree crab. So the tree crab is actually different than most crabs because he's flatter in structure. His legs are spread out to the side. They're not propped up like most crabs, which are going to be running along the soil or down in the mud or the water. So he's got his legs flattened out alongside him more. He still has joints, but he still likes to stay flatter to the tree. He doesn't want to get blown off in the wind or plucked off very easily. So he's going to stay flat to the tree. He's also camouflaged to where he will blend in with the tree. You can see he's kind of has a muddled kind of grayish dark look to him and some white speckles on him to kind of blend in with the bark. He's got points on the ends of his legs which also help him to climb and also hairs. And if you look at his eyes, they're very different to most crabs. Most crabs have their eyes up on stalks, up on high. This crab has his eyes along the side, almost like a frog, because he is always looking around the tree branch. He's always going from one side of the tree branch to the other, so he's, he wants to see from one side to the other. 